Next we're going to do some sailing. Sailing is one of my personal favorites. If you can see here we actually have some pretty good pieces here showing up what you can do, how to do them. It has a lot more instructions to it than some of the others so I'm pretty happy with that. We also have a function now that holds it until player has hit the OK. This is the new function that was just added very recently by our lead developer Russ. Thank you Russ. That's something that has been bothering me for a while. He's even managed to include the lovely uh, scoring right above whenever you clear things. And that's going to be a big part of keeping the game intriguing to people. Like they'll be able to see the score that you receive for whatever action you do. It's very important to have that feedback and sometimes in a lot of the current puzzle pirates, I genuinely don't know what score I'm getting. Talk to me about carpentry. You can, you can tell me that I'm getting points. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking they're kind of making it up based on somebody's guess and a lot of uh, a lot of math that somebody did at one point. And maybe if I get the piece I need, I can show the combo scoring here. All right, here we go. Let's watch this combo roll. As you can see, the scoring gets quite high quite quickly. We do not have the rating system yet. That one is still under development. I can only badger Russ so many times in a day before he decides that he wants to spend time with family or loved ones or just not hear the sound of my melodious voice anymore. As you can see, different things have different point scores assigned to them. The blocks are going to be worth more than the actual uh, little balls themselves, the little icons. But all of them are going to be worth something. For this one, I've been curious what I'm going to do power-up wise. There's some ideas I've had, but I'm such a diehard for it. It is This one is my game, the one that I'm the best at whenever I'm playing in Puzzle Pirates. So it's hard for me to re-envision it in a way that would make it better for people who... Ah! We're still having some bug problems, ladies and gentlemen. This one is one that we haven't even been really hitting hard because it's been having bug problems like this. Everything seems to still be running, but... Now something weird has happened, and we don't even know. Things aren't even scoring right. Such is the life of a game developer. I am looking forward to making a lot of progress on this, as it was going to be core to sailing. We don't know if we're going to be getting the second sailing game, though. The current one, I should say. That will be a question for a future development. We do have a good fail function that is working, which is more important than you think when uh, you think of a game could just be destroyed if you... Working may be a more subjective term than I thought. We also have some anti-gravity features that we are adding into the game, where you'll be able to just anti-gravity things right through it. Anyways, any of you uh, sailing veterans out there who want to give uh, a couple of ideas of where you'd like to see things progress to, if you have any power-up ideas, let me know. I'm, I'd be interested to hear some of them. I have a short list, which I'd like to run by people, of course. feel like it'd be a fun thing to try out. 